Okay, today we're gonna learn how to find the slope from a graph. Let's say this graph is given, and then we need to identify two points. I will say, uh, in this case, the points are also given, but the points that we're gonna pick is any two points on the line that pick the points that are on the uh, on an edge, okay? Like on, on, a com on a complete corner. So in this case, will be negative two comma three and negative one comma zero. So when we have the graph, we can use rise over run. Rise over run means uh, how many units are moving up and down divided by how many units I will move left to right. In this case, I'm gonna move down. How many units? Three, and I'm gonna move one unit to the right. So my rise will be negative three units because I'm moving down, and my run will be one unit positive because I'm moving to the right. Just remember, if I move down, it's negative. If I move up, it's positive. So the slope will be negative three divided by one. The slope will be negative three. Another way to find the slope when we got a graph is use the two points and label the points, like x of the first point, y of the second point, x of the second point, y of the second point, and use the two-point formula. The two-point formula, as I said before, it will work on a, any scenario, like two points given, table, graph, okay? So the two-point formula, we can, we can use it every time. So it will be zero minus three, and negative one minus negative two. And we can simplify this as negative three divided by one and my slope is negative three. So as we can see, the answer is the same for the slope if we use rise over run or if we use the two point formula. Let's go over another example. We got uh, this graph, we're gonna use rise over run. Okay, in this case, we're moving up. Okay, so when we're gonna move up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven units, and then we're gonna move to the right three units. That's why it's positive because I'm moving up and then moving three to the right, so also it's positive. So this one, seven divided by three cannot be simplified. We leave it as, as a fraction and that will be my slope, seven thirds. Or another way to find it, the slope is using the two points, four comma three and one comma negative four, two points that are on the edge, and then use the two-point formula. But before using the two-point formula, we need to label it. S sub one, which is x, x of the first point, y of the first point, x of the second point, y of the second point. Use the two-point formula, and then evaluate or substitute three minus negative four, and four minus one. So in this case, I'm gonna have three, this becomes positive, three plus four is seven, four minus one is three. And as we say, we cannot simplify, we leave it like that. And as we can see, it's the same as slope using rise over run or using the two point formula. Those are the two options that you have to find the slope when you, the graph is given, okay?